Over here is a piece of cotton. Here's a piece of cotton that's been chemically treated. We're going to observe the burning characteristics of both of these. There's the piece of cotton. Woo! There's the piece of cotton that's been chemically treated. That's a big difference, isn't there? Here I have a piece of cotton, a piece of paper towel. This is a piece of cotton that's been chemically treated. And this is a piece of paper towel that's been chemically treated. The cotton and the paper towel probably contain somewhere between 70 and 90 percent cellulose. This chemically treated piece of cotton has been treated with a mixture of sulfuric and nitric acid. And what has gone on there is the cellulose in the cotton has been nitrated. This is a paper towel that has also been uh, nitrated through that chemical procedure. So what I'm going to do here, I'm going to take away the pieces of paper towel first. And we're going to compare this piece of cotton to this piece of cotton that's been treated, nitrated. I'm just going to try to burn the piece of cotton. You can watch the way that catches fire and look at its characteristics. And then, over here, I'm going to burn this piece of cotton that's been nitrated. It's a pretty big difference in their uh, characteristics of how they burn. The nitrated compound burns much more quickly. That's because the oxygen content, the ratio of oxygen in the, in the nitrated cellulose is much higher than the ratio of oxygen in the, um, in the cellulose from the cotton. Let's try the same thing here with, I'm going to just move these out of the way. All right, we're going to try the same thing here with uh, the paper towel and the paper towel that's been nitrated. So here's our paper towel, watch how that burns. And then we're going to try the same thing with the paper towel that's been nitrated. 